cycling and filming at the same time. Well, give this a try. Um, oh my goodness, there we go. I nearly went in the ditch. Well, good morning. I've been on the road now for what, 27, 25, 26 kilometers now? I left this morning at 8.28 for my 100 mile epic ride and raising money for charity. And I'd like to take this opportunity to thank all those that actually donated before I got on the road. And so I'm really, really happy that you did that. Thank you very much. So everything's looking good. The sun's come out. It's beautiful, sunny. I'm on my way to the Pine Grove Trail now. And then I'll head out towards Rigo and then make my way down south towards Alexandria and uh, I'll probably check in with you then. Actually just being out here in the nature, listening to the odd crow, little insects, there just isn't anything better. Honestly there is nothing better. I'm glad you've all come along with me and I really do appreciate it and helping to give me the motivation to do this, raising money for respiratory uh, research. So I really do appreciate all the donations that you've been giving so far. Thank you very much indeed. I thought I'd show you what I'm carrying for my 100 mile epic ride. Uh, food etc and a few odds and ends in case I run into a few problems so let's have a look um, I got my I brought this little survival blanket so I can I can obviously use this to keep me warm or I can uh, put up a little shelter and uh, wait for somebody to come and save me a banana looking a bit worse for wear so I think I'm gonna eat that shortly so let's put that there for now a little lock uh, in case I need to nip into a store. I can at least lock the bike up for the five minutes it'll take to pop in and get a sandwich or a drink or whatever I need. Rear light. Some spare Gatorade. Obviously my wallet, some money, some ID, etc. These are my sandwiches which I'm going to tuck into shortly. And I also brought with me an apple and a little tangerine here. I've got a basic first aid kit, of course, in case I, God forbid, come off the bike or whatever, or something happens. I've got some basic stuff in here, polysporin, band-aids, compression bandage, a couple of uh, safety pins, um, enough to get me by. And uh, something to clean my glasses, some tissue paper. You never know when you need to go well, you know, you get the idea. A little knife, pocket knife, in case I need to open something. Some cables. Uh, both USB and the micro. Uh, a a solar, solar panel recharger, so that I'm able to recharge my phone or my lights. Uh, or my uh, computer if I, I need to on the go. So this should keep me going oh, for at least two or three charges easily. Of course on the bike uh, I'm carrying some uh, water in this little camel back here. Uh, I have my phone attached here, front light and my computer. You know this stopping and starting and riding past and all the rest of it with the camera for the editing and the fun of it and making it look like I've got some kind of a production team going on here actually adds kilometers. Sure of it. Yeah few what the Tour de France would say bumps in the road here. Can't really call them hills but uh, yeah. <sighs> so just over 80 kilometers in so it's halfway. So I would guess another five hours on the bike but yes we are going to get it done. Really appreciate all the sponsors for the respiratory fundraiser. But yes, we are going to get the 100 miles done today.
Well, I arrived in Alexandria, so that's just over a hundred um, kilometers now. And I couldn't resist a patat frit, so I got myself a patin small and a hot dog all dressed and a ginger ale. Relax for a bit. I've just got, what, just under 70 kilometers to go. Still a beautiful day and we still have some sun. The 43 offers a nice little hard shoulder here to ride on and the asphalt is very smooth. So everything is going really well. So I'm at 115, 116 kilometers now. So thank you again for all those who have sponsored for the respiratory fundraiser. I really do appreciate it. It's motivated me. It's a beautiful day. The sun is just beating down and it's super warm. It's been a brilliant day so far. So I'll get back to you again uh, to, to wrap up. Thanks again for coming along with me. Really appreciate it. Thank you. Whoa! Oh, I thought he was driving right into his corn. And now there's a little trail there. I'm on 159.4 kilometers, I'm in Castleman, and I'm uh, 8 kilometers from my house, so that should do it. So that's my 100 miles done today. So if you like this kind of content, I'll do a few more cycle rides, scuba diving, whatever I happen to be doing at the time. Uh, thanks for coming along with me, I really do appreciate it, and um, it was a fantastic day. Thanks for coming along with me, bye.